It's Thursday, May 22nd, 2014. I'm Janice Yamoka, and this is DX Daily. First, Yasin Bey, formerly known as Mos Def, was reportedly denied re-entry into the United States. News broke when the Together Boston Festival, after having to cancel their show, wrote, We regret to inform you that due to immigration slash legal issues, Yasin Bey is unable to enter back into the United States, and his upcoming U.S. tour has been canceled. Last year, the MC, who was reportedly born in New York, relocated to South Africa. He has yet to comment on this matter, but Yasin, immigration slash legal issues? What's going on? Rick Ross has been slimming down, and now he shares his weight loss tips with the world. In a shirtless interview with Tim Westwood, Ross explains how he got his quote-unquote God body. Hint, it involves eating fruit and actual gym time. He says that he's added a food group to his daily intake, fruit, and he forgot how fruit had tasted like, but now he eats pears as well as other fruits. As far as the gym, the boss says the closest thing he's done to a workout was when he stood up to count money. Humble brag, now he does Ross Fit. Check out the clip. I still eat the way I want to eat. Still I eat. still, right, I just go to the gym. So it's the gym which is doing I do, it. I do this um, shit called uh, CrossFit. I call it Ross Fit. Ross Fit. Yeah, 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 it's called Ross Fit now. Thanks for sharing the tips. CrossFit and pears, noted. Do rappers still need blogs or do the blogs still need the artists? Funk Volume CEO Damian Ritter discusses. Ritter, who used to think blogs served artists, started asking this question when he began to see artists with a strong social network presence, share links, and in turn be more beneficial to blogs. He talks about why reaching out to hip hop blogs was a waste of time, saying that after literally sending out hundreds of emails, he got exactly zero responses. His advice, don't stress about getting coverage from blogs and focus on making the best art you can make. Take note and make sure you read what a CEO who has a profitable music business has to say. Those are today's top headlines. For more music and news, log on to hiphopdx.com.